Hello. In this video, I will show you how to edit the Wix event page. Edit the uh, multi-language. So I have a Wix website. I have an event over here. What I don't have is uh, the multi-language. So I need to add the multi-language first. So you need to log in to the uh, control panel. And then go to uh, refresh. So now you go to the settings, choose language and region, add language. So it will pop up the plugin. Let's add it to the website. Go to editor. Now you need to make sure the multi language is enabled to your website. So first thing you need to do is to add this one to site. And uh, you need to select the current uh, site language. So I will choose English first. And now I want uh, the second language to Chinese, OK? You need to make sure this one is out to transfer first. But uh, after you auto transfer, you can still add the translation because some uh, sometimes uh, because it's using Google Translate, sometimes it's not uh, transfer correct. Okay, and also you need to make sure the second language is visible. You need to enable it. Otherwise, when you otherwise. If you uh, not enable it, you won't see the language bar here. Okay. So you need to make sure this tool uh, enable. Okay. Continue. Okay. So let's go back to my website now. Wait a moment. Oh, you need uh, another thing is you need to uh, click out to translate site button again and then uh, you need to publish it. Okay, let's uh, refresh my website. Oh, where it is? Publish. Let's go back to here. So, after that, I have two uh, language bar. You need to delete one of this. It's a bug of the weeks. Okay. So let's publish it again and uh, refresh my website. OK, now it has the uh, language bar here. Let's check my event page. So go to the second language. And you can see the event page, the title is not transfer correct. So how to Added this translation, you can go to your control panel again. Then you need because the multi language menu not show up yet, but you need to refresh your control panel page. After that, you will see the multi language, multi, multilingual uh, menu here. Then you can select Wix events. Click that, 
and you will see the translate button here. Click it, it will show all the events, include the past event. So if you have uh, thousands of event posts already, it's not easy to find the your, your event that you want to add it. So that's uh, one of the Wix design problem. Anyway, I only have three, so it's easy for me to find it. I click the translate button again, and then I can see the title of my event. Where is my title in my event? I search it. Oh, it's at the end, event name, okay? So the title they put on the very bottom, okay? Anyway, <coughs> you can edit it over here. And after you add it, you need to check the save event button here. Otherwise, it won't update. Okay, so next time when you try to, for example, here, you don't have the event save button. What you can do is you do something, add some uh, word here. So after you add some, some word here, the save button will show, then you can click. If it not show up again, you can select the Google transfer button and select replace. After that, the save button will show up and you can start editing. Then you save it. Okay, so that's how you edit all your event details to multi-language. Hope you enjoy this video. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.